yeah, so a lot of people try to place your accent. They're like, where are you from? And obviously my accent might not be as strong as a man that grew up in the middle of town, you know, but I still think I have an accent. I don't sound like an American, but I would get that quite often. People would never believe that I'd be from the Caribbean because their perception is that no one from the Caribbean can be white. So that was huge, and that used to annoy me <laughs> quite a bit as well because they would always guess, oh, you're Irish, or you're British, or you're Australian, or you're American, so many different things. So in that way, like with the accent, people didn't believe I was from the Caribbean. And people do have the perception that a lot of the Caribbean is still underdeveloped. You know, you get... Not as much now, but even one person is like, oh, y'all don't all live in, you know, huts on the beach. And I say, are you serious? I mean, really. But you can't, you can't judge them for not knowing. Barbados is a small place to them. If they grew up in a really, really small town in the middle of, I don't know, in the boonies in Canada or wherever you call them, you know, they wouldn't. They might not know Barbados. So I used to get annoyed. And then I was like, you know what? Take a step back because you don't know every little town everywhere. And I mean, sometimes I do have perceptions of what people look like in certain places in Africa or other places. I mean, obviously, I am more educated now and do a lot of research. But in that way, with the accent and that, that overall general perception that no one from the Caribbean can be white. And I also get that here a lot at home. You know, people do not believe that there can be a white Bajan. But my family came here in 1620, whatever. So why can't I be Bajan? Maybe I didn't come from Africa. But I, I was born here, I've lived here. Most of my family's from here or other places in the Caribbean. So that's, that's what I identify with, that's why I am. So my experience with that, it used to be like a bit of frustration. And then I was like, okay, no, take a step back and educate instead. So, yeah.